the local misfire prevention contest uh, in Nashville. That's how I got into broadcasting, because in the midst of the contest, they asked a question about what do you want to do or what do you want to be? Uh, and I said, because I had Barbara Walters in my head from that morning, I want to be a journalist. I want to express my views to the world and using other people's ideas to change the world and blah, 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 blah. Whatever the answer was, I, I was I, it was an out-of-body experience. But the reason why I said journalist, because everybody else said things like, well, I want to be a nurse, I want to be a teacher. This was Nashville. So, uh, <laughs> so I think I was just really trying to come up with something that somebody else hadn't said. And so that, then after I said it, I thought, well, that might be a good idea. <laughs> Really? That is exactly how that happened for me. Well, I say that I want to be the next Oprah Winfrey. <laughs> That'll work for you. That'll, so move over to That'll work for you. Oh, I was right there. Have a seat. <laughs> no. And then, um, then I went to, to the station. I ended up winning that darn contest. When the year I won, which I think was 71, but the year I won the contest, you had to have red hair up until the year I won. So it was like... <laughs> Until the year I won, <laughs> you had to have red hair. So I sort of broke the mold for that. That kind of changed things. So I went back to the WBOL radio station to pick up my prize, which was a Longines watch and a clock radio. <laughs> and in the process of um, walking through the radio station, they were giving like a tour, like, would you like to see our newsroom? They sat, sat me down and said, would you like to hear your voice on tape, little girly? <laughs> Would you like to hear your voice on tape, little girl? And I sat down and I read some news copy and was hired on the spot. Oh my God. Yes. That is my story. I was 16. I was 16. Hi, YouTubers. I'm excited to give you an update about our own YouTube channel. Now you can find new videos every day. They're the kind of videos that will make you look at life differently. They may even make you laugh a little bit. Who doesn't need a daily dose of that? So here's just a taste of some of what you'll see.